In this video, I'm going to talk about how you can estimate the between subjects factor omnibus main effect means in SPSS because it's not very obvious how you can get those means. Now, I've already talked about this issue in the long video devoted to the mixed design ANOVA 2x3 CBT versus discussion group therapy. However, I'm going to point it out again here just very briefly. So here is the setup, the mixed design ANOVA with three levels in the within subjects factor. And I've also got the between subjects factor here. Now, if you click on options, there's descriptive statistics here. and You'll get the means and standard deviations, but you will not get it for the between subjects main effect. You're just going to get the interaction effect means and standard deviations. And you'll also get the within subjects factor main effect means. You don't get the between subjects. Now, depending on the version of SPSS you have, you may see a button here called EM means, which is estimated marginal means. If you want to get the main effect means associated with the between subjects factor, you must include group in display means for. And you can compare main effects, which would make sense if you add three or more levels. But in this case here, there are only two levels in the group factor. So click on, once you have group there, click continue. Next, go in the options box and click descriptive statistics just to see that you don't get them, that you don't get the between subjects main effect means. Click continue. Click OK. And here are the descriptive statistics. And these total means here refer to the pretreatment, which is in the within subjects factor, 30.57 for post treatment, and 27.58. These are the three within subjects main effect factor means. And of course, these means here are associated with the interaction. There are no between subjects main effect means. If you scroll down, however, here is the estimated marginal means for the group. And these means here are tested for statistical significance with the group main effect F test. So you do not get these means, 31.70 and 33.909, in this table here. You must go through the estimated marginal means. Now, if you have a version of SPSS that's earlier than version 25, then you won't see this button here, estimated marginal means where you would get the option to estimate the estimated marginal means is in the options button. And it would be above this window. This window would be much bigger in version 24 and earlier. And above here, you would see the option to put group into the estimated marginal means box like this. So that is how you can get the between subjects factor main effect means in SPSS.